Hello, Church of the Servant. Pastor Andrew here. Uh, we are into the month of September, this month where we are leaning into prayer together as a congregation, uh, where we are seeking God's face, where we are seeking God's kingdom, where we are reorienting our lives around God's heart and his desires for us together. We're going through the book, Pray the Word for Your Church by Ty King. So I hope you are finding those daily prayers posted by video or you have the book already. Uh, please continue to pray daily uh, for um, God's will for us together. In addition to these daily prayers, we're also having four weekly themes during this September prayer month. Unity, justice, reconciliation, and guidance. So this coming week, we will kick off the theme of unity. Our theme verse is from Ephesians chapter 4. Paul writes, I, therefore, the prisoner of the Lord, a prisoner in the Lord, beg you to lead a life worthy of the calling to which you have been called, with all humility and gentleness, with patience, bearing with one another in love, making every effort to maintain the unity of the Spirit in the bond of peace. Unity. What a time to pray for unity. Within the church, within our society, within our nation, around the world. I'm reminded of Jesus' prayer <laughs> that we... God's people would be one as Jesus and the Father are one. I'm reminded of that and thankful uh, that Jesus' prayer is not just wishful thinking. This calling of unity, Jesus' prayer for unity, is rooted in the good news that we have been reconciled to God and one another. So unity is a gift before it is a calling. And because it is God's gift to us, we can receive it, we can live into it. We don't have to manufacture it. Uh, and yet we do have to seek it uh, with purpose, um, with prayer. And so this week, let's pray together for a deeper spirit of unity in the Church of the Servant, that we would learn how to bear with one another in love um, in the midst of disagreements and differences. Um, we're reminded that... Um, we are not a social club. We are not uh, some gathering of like-minded individuals. We are a gathering of God's spirit. We are a creation of God's word. We are a people in Jesus Christ. Uh, and the church is called to be today what the world will be one day. So friends, as we seek to embody Jesus' prayer uh, for the church, as we seek to be a light, uh, to a culture that is so fractured and divided. Um, we, we, we lean into this um, by God's grace and through prayer. So uh, I hope you've um, seen the, um, the prayer guide for each week, um, those four themes. Um, those will be available online as well. So as you go through the daily prayers, remember uh, this theme of unity uh, for this week. And may God be glorified and may um, our neighbors take notice that we have um, a unity that is only explainable because God is with us. May God bless you, friends.